If your Reddit username would predict the way you die, how will it happen? I'm sure it would be epic, or salt, I'd be alright. Damn that's a clean username, I mean he has had it for 8 years. Twisted into a balloon animal. Better death than mine. Well, seeing as my ship won't sail, I'm probably going to rot in the middle of an ocean. Or die in harbor during a hurricane. Ascension to greater squid. Uh oh I'm in trouble, as am malnutrition. Better than dehydration. No, no, there's just no running water. Chin up, it could be dysentery from a dirty well. By a Finnish sniper. Or drowning in vanilla ice cream monsieur. One or the, no, being consumed by cream. Vanilla ice is stand. Iggy, get out of here, he's still alive, I will lose my bubble wrap, or you could just get far too wrapped up in bubble wrap. I will overdose on rice I guess edit. This thread has turned into a rice recipe book with rice haters sprinkled in between. 10 out of 10 with rice. My username has never felt more appropriate. You and me both. You're bringing down the whole ship with you. Please do you have to wonder, is it by volume or by force? Why not by HM? I guess I'd get shot in a dark alley. Could be anybody by any method, I suppose. Unsolved murder. I've watched 14 seasons of Criminal Minds. I got this by having sex with someone asterisk else. No, he said R-E-D-D-I-T-O-R. Uh? Smother, but suppose you received an image of such monstrous proportions that you simply die from shock. I wish you the best of luck, tit hunter. Death by, seems realistic. More specifically, human number 7264. Obama no. Thanks Obama. But, you're used, I am deeply sorry. Guess I have AIDS now, not even a doctor of my caliber can save you. I diagnose you with dead. Well this is awkward. Agree, these two comments together are just hilarious. Oh uh, monsieur, to shreds you say? How's his wife holding up? Hit full force by JK rolling rolling down a hill. Your epitaph will read that you were actually gay all along. Snape was a single mother, I become a father and then succumb to cancer. No no no, you become cancer and have a child. No he has a child and it is cancer. Oh boy, I'm in trouble, sounds terrifying tbh. By a fire, 2340 shots of fireball. I will die the way I live, licks finger turns pay, you, penis underscore bees is already in the bad place, I'll have my kneecaps busted, through a terrible misunderstanding that could have easily been avoided had I just checked up on a little more information. So like any given sitcom episode, Laugh trap, suicide, no need to be pessimistic, you might also die of a broken heart because you have outlived everyone that you cared for. See, isn't that much more uplifting? Nah, those are general sad feelings, not specific ones. HM, could there be a general named sad feelings? It would be extremely painful for you. Lousy on and sports fans for 24 hours straight sounds painful too. Prostate cancer that hits me like the speed of light squared. That made me chuckle. My condolences. The, is he dead? Oh God, death by 87,974 wolves. I'm fuck. You will interact peacefully with 87,973 wolves. It'll be wolf 87,974 that kills you. All 87,973 wolves rip him apart bit by bit. Wolf number 173 finishes off your left index finger. Number 658 is starting down at your right thigh. Number 8001 and number 8002 are having a fine dinner over your eyelids. Love birds, the both of them is here. Painful for you, but seeing what love is like up close really was an eye-opening experience. I go to the bar and piss off an Irishman while engaging in conversation. He asks me what year I was born and I tell him, 92. The man has been brooding since our last meeting and decides he wants to eliminate me instead of talking out our problems. He grabs his rifle that he used when he was in the service as a marksman. He waits until April 2nd to kill me. 
since that is 92 days into the year and also the year in which I told him I was born. An amp, hash x200b, boom, I am expired. April f it's a leap year next year, April fools. Pretty self-explanatory, hello everyone, it is I Donald J. Trump. And in today's vlog we are going to find out how many likes it takes to get to the center of a Redditor, C-H-O-M-P, with lots of glitter and kitty, or a sociopathic shiny monstrosity. Stopped, dropped, and rolled. Didn't work, I didn't get some odd bark, or you did, but just not where you wanted it, I wouldn't be here for it. Tilda edit, I didn't expect this to get any attention at all tbh. Crazy, thanks for the awards, upvotes and those really cool comments turning this into a whole movie plot. I can't help imagining you giving death the slip, every time. Like Final Destination but instead of the universe doing its level best to kill you it's actively trying to make sure you never die. That would be both the best and worst superhero. I choked to death on self, well, slowly. Oh god please no. While the bull is distracted with you, I'm free to keep doing my thing. Thanks but fortunately for you and unfortunately for op. The human anus can stretch quite wide. So you should have plenty of time for last minute preparations. Ah, I'm so sorry. I think he might have been moaning, my guy, in a microbus. I die protecting your mom's head. Thank you for your service. I don't even want to know. Probably E. coli or suffocation. Heart attack. I'm taking you all with me. Overconsumption of bean. Damn. Vodka. Definitely garbanzo. I am going to die tomorrow, agreeably. Guess I'm gonna die to itch in chiller named Thomas. I drown. Drowning, for sure. Glub. Glub glub. Attacked by 77 devil chickens. Link. It's my name. Backwards. So does that mean I'd be killing myself backwards? Killed by mirror doppelganger. Rip. I will have to walk the plank. Never thought I'd become a werewolf, but there you go. You survived 51 silver bullets before dying. Good job. Somebody's gonna forget me. And then you just let your imagination run wild. Will I starve to death locked in a small room? Will I be left in a desert and die of dehydration, lack of salt? Or maybe I'll end up lost in the Russian tundra where the rescue team forgets about me and I succumb to hypothermia. The options are endless. Five men will do unspeakable things to me. Barbecued on diamonds, sign me. Pretty sure someone's gonna grill your testicles until you're dead. But that's a much more pleasant interpretation. Or it could be a full-sized grill spontaneously appears in your genitals. Well I'm like a solid five, five tenths, so I'm imagining like a handsome Squidward door to the face scenario where some blunt force trauma kills me but also leaves me looking like a perfect ten. Oh god no. I spend a lot of time in high voltage substations so, at least the cremation would be free. Glass, half full I guess. Well, I'm definitely not burning to death. Saying hello to bandit makes sense. Yeah, but only when you say hello the third time do they get really pissed off and shoot you. By the sun demon Sarah.